Glory to Jesus Christ. We've seen how surrounding ourselves visually with iconography or good religious art, especially art like Michelangelo's that uses the human body, can be very helpful in trying to prevent lust and pornography. But so can some forms of secular art that use the human body properly. Here's a masterpiece by Renoir that uses, obviously, the naked human body. St. John Paul II said, The naked human body is not an occasion for lust in itself. Rather, it's how it's presented and how it's received. In other words, the ethos of seeing. Paintings like this have a certain beauty to them. There's a certain innocence in this moment here, even though these girls are naked. There's also a flow, a beautiful flow, a beautiful visual rhythm that moves through this whole painting. Repeated patterns of the circular shape through the trees and their bodies. All this presents a certain harmony in the mind and the heart and the eye, and also a sense of beauty, order, and the dignity of the human person. Surrounding ourselves with good art, whether religious or secular, can actually be very helpful in training our eye and our mind and our heart to see correctly, to ward off lust and pornography. Glory to Jesus Christ.